it met first it met in the school and then it met here built an original uh, kind of classroom building with a fellowship hall which is now covered up by other buildings that have been added on but in the heart of this there is a original classroom building and Bill had a little bit to do with that as he was uh, one of the original members of the church he and his wife some of the angles that are in this building were in those classrooms but they're now they're all kind of covered up. Uh, tell me about Bill Hinton and his design. Well, Bill Hinton was a local Tulsa architect. He was an active member of this church. He and his wife were. And so when the church had grown, it was a neighborhood church here at 35th and Harvard, or 36th and Harvard. And at, uh, as it grew and needed a sanctuary, why uh, they went to Bill and asked him if he would be the architect for it. And in this building, he really used the, the, made the use of angles every place, and particularly uh, the hexagon, and uh, designed it so that the building so it just uses it. The floor pan is a, a hexagon. The, the, uh, he used a design of a, a, what, kind of a, a shield uh, look that's all around the building. It's a six-sided figure. Uh, uh, the Things on the chancel or on the stage of the church are all designed in that way. The altar table is designed with those angles in it. It's just uh, very interesting, and he made them all fit together in a way that's surprising. One well, interesting thing he did about it, the, the uh, you know, cross is a center part in any church building, and at the end of the back end of the pews are crosses, and but at the front uh, of the church, uh, there's usually a cross, and there's a cross that is, in a very interesting way, it's a, it's two six-sided, two hexagons made into a cross. It began to grow in the late 70s and 80s and, and 90s, and so that uh, some more space was needed, and so added uh, the two wings on it, and it was a uh, the church was very concerned to keep the same look in every kind of way, to buy the same brick that were on the rest of the building, to uh, be able to move the stained glass windows so they could be still. And so it was all, there was an integrity of the architectural design. Larry Johnston was the architect on the expansion, and he was able to keep that look very, very clearly. It, it complemented Bill Hinton's earlier design but complemented this Frank Lloyd Wright kind of use of angles. There, you know, as a pastor, they're, they're really a hazard. I mean, you, you know, a lady with high heels going down those stairs, they, yeah. never, we never had anybody ever fall on those stairs until on one occasion, the architect's wife She's the one who fell. <laughs> Didn't hurt herself, but she fell down the stairs. <laughs> she was the only one.